Good morning, guys. This is the uh, first day of Government 101. Hope you're all in the right class. I'm Mr. Johnson. Uh, who was awake this summer? Who paid attention to what went on in the United States of America? What happened really big this summer for our United States government? Anybody? Anyone? Um, Travis. Yeah. Um, Dr. J came out with a new album. Yeah. Woo. Yeah, I'm a fan, but no, that's not what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is the Supreme Court decision on gay marriage. Who knows about that? Anybody? Okay, let's go a little further. The Supreme Court voted on gay marriage being legal and or not legal. Five to four. You know what? It's a new school year, new faces. Let's take a quick poll. Who in here agrees with gay marriage? Raise your hand. All right, yeah, yeah. Who disagrees? What are you, conservative? <laughs> All right, we'll see. Who doesn't know? One, two, all right. Well, by the end of this week, we're gonna take another vote and see where we all stand at. Let's get on to the next topic. Josh, yeah? what happened, man? You're supposed to be backing me up? Dude, I'm just trying to pass the class, all right? Dude, what, what would you say if your parents were there? You would raise your hand there. It's just school, right? It's not church or anything. Don't worry about it. What's happening, Josh? What's up, Travis? What's going on, man? You know, I just trying to survive Johnson's class, you know. Man, don't even get me started on that class, dude. I can't even listen to my music. That ain't. Hey, Travis, don't forget to bring the drinks, all right? Hey, I got you, dude. I got the hookup. Don't you worry. You coming tonight? To what? To the party, man. Oh, what time is it? It's uh, it's tonight. Tonight? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I'll be there. I'll be there. You're alright, dude. You're yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm fine. All right, man. Well, I'll pick you up at seven, okay? Alright, see you tonight. Yeah. Yo, Josh, you coming or what? Mom, Dad, I'm leaving. Uh, no, you're not. <laughs> yeah? Son, it's Monday. Nobody had outreaches on Mondays. But, Dad, they're already outside. Sorry, son. Now, either you go outside and tell them that you're not going, or I'll go tell them. Dad, come on. You're Josh, away. you're being selfish. And you're being stupid. I told you a couple of times now politely. You're coming to outreach. Period. But I want to end of story. It's about time. Oh, sorry, man, I can't go. What? Are you serious? Travis, this guy can't go. What? Are you serious? Man, we've been waiting out here for you this whole time, and now you barely tell us that you're not going? I still have somebody to pick up. Man, forget you, dude. I told you this guy would play with us, Travis. I know she didn't talk to anybody tonight. Hello? Hey, I just met Veronica.
his house. The fellowship went on longer than usual, like I thought, but I'm on my way home now. Hey, listen, would you mind picking up some food for the house? Yeah, okay, I will, but I might be a little wild still. There's a lot of traffic, and I think there's a wreck somewhere. All right, honey. I'll see you when you get home. All right, I love you. Love you, too. Bye. A second teen has died following a massive crash on I-10 late this afternoon. Deputies say that the young driver of a white and blue Chevy was headed east around 7.30 p.m. and lost control due to being distracted. Witnesses say the driver flew over the median right into oncoming traffic, hitting a black semi head-on. Some good Samaritans then rushed to pull out the young passenger of the white truck after it caught fire. The teenager was then taken to the hospital where he died soon after. There's a lot of traffic, and I think there's a wreck somewhere. You coming tonight? Travis, this guy can't go. Listen, son. I've told you a couple of times now politely. You're coming to outreach, period. Are you all right, Josh? I heard what happened to Travis and Kyle. Hasn't everyone? They don't seem to care. Why should you? We don't know where they went. Well, I know. You could have you changed that. It's too late now. God's called you to be a leader. Why do you think Travis and Kyle hung around with you? You need to stand up for what you believe in and you know try to get other people to say. For that to happen, you need to surrender yourself to God. You, know, you need to accept Jesus Christ into your heart. Do you want that? Morning class. First week of school. Here we go, one down, plenty to go. We hit a couple topics this week, but we talked about one in specific on Monday. Gay marriage, right? We talked about having another poll today. Let's hit that up, guys. Okay, who supports gay marriage? Raise your hand. Awesome. Who doesn't support gay marriage? What? Two conservatives now? Josh it is. What, did Matt convince you of this decision? Last I checked, you didn't have an opinion. Correct? Um, yes, yes sir. Uh, I was one of the few. I might add that Matt did not convince me. Is that so? Yes sir. Who here would be bold enough to say that they are a Christian? Then why don't you raise your hands in opposition? The Bible says otherwise, like 1 Corinthians 6, 9, 11 says that no homosexual shall enter the kingdom of heaven. So why are you supporting the act when you're just giving them like permission not to enter heaven? Josh, there's no need to bring up religion. No, Mr. Johnson, there's an eternal need to do so. Because we're all going to die one day, and like whether you make heaven your home or not, is it's your choice. So tell me, as of right now, where will you spend eternity? <laughs> 